Absolute madness happening in the football card market today, everybody. Welcome in to the weekly football card market report on the Sports Card Strategy Show feed right here on the NoOffSeason.com Sports Card Network. I'm Paul Hickey. This is your weekly football card market update. Madness, madness in the football card market with these oversized downtowns hitting the market over the last couple of weeks from these Donruss bundle boxes from Costco. What is going on? Let's get into the data right here. Caleb Williams, his 2024 Donruss rated rookie base raw is the most sold football card in the market from a rookie card standpoint, raw or graded over the last seven days. Here it is, the rated rookie for Caleb. 201 sales in the last seven days, according to Market Movers. You can use the promo code no off season over at marketmoversapp.com right now to save 20% off for life. Average sale price of this card, $24. Jaden Daniels, his 2020 score 302 base raw, sold 165 times for an average sale price of $4.06. But why would you buy the score when you can go buy the Don Russ rated rookie of Jaden Daniels 2024? Don Russ, 389 base raw is the third most sold football card in the last seven days. 140 sales of this card for just a couple dollars less than Caleb, believe it or not. $21.65. Then we get into the oversized downtowns. I don't even know what to say about these. There's going to be more on tomorrow's Sports Card Strategy full episode on what the heck this means for the football card market. But Jaden Daniels, his 2024 Don Russ oversized downtown Raw sold 139 times in the last seven days. Average sale price, $135. Drake May next, oversized downtown, 117 sales. Average sale price, $72. Caleb Williams, oversized downtown, 98 sales, 124 average sale price. Michael Penix Jr., oversized downtown, 81 sales. $44 average sale price. JJ McCarthy, Malik Neighbors oversized downtown, selling 78 and uh, 76 times respectively for $65 and $52 respectively. Brock Bowers oversized downtown, selling 71 times for $48. I don't even know what to say about these. I don't know if these are a play or not. We're going to dig into it more on tomorrow's Sports Card Strategy Show. But the oversized downtowns are blowing my mind right now because I don't know if PSA is grading these. I don't know if any grading company has a slab to fit them. I don't know how big they are. What I do know about them is that they're coming out of these Donruss bundle boxes that are apparently only available at retail at Costco, although Dave and & Adams and Steel City Collectibles are selling them, uh, but they are sold out at Steel City, sold out at Dave & Adams. So it appears that Costco is the only place that you can get these. There's a lot going on online around these. It's making it harder for people to sell the actual case hit downtowns. They're different than the case hit downtowns. Downtowns are still a case hit. These oversized downtowns, you're guaranteed one of them in these bundle boxes. It's very, very interesting. I don't know what these are going to do for the overall sale price of the regular downtowns moving forward but I see eBay listings of actual Caleb Williams real case hit downtowns where the seller has to prove that it's not an oversized downtown. Just so weird. Uh, is it a money grab by Panini? We'll talk more about it. All right, now let's look at graded football cards by sales volume in the last seven days. Rookie cards. Caleb Williams hot right now after his big performance in London two weeks ago. Of course, the Bears had the bye week this past week. Caleb Williams, 2024 Tops Now Draft Base D1 PSA 10 is the most graded sold rookie card in the football card market in the last seven days. 62 sales of that card for an average sale price of $58.02, followed by CJ Stroud's 2023 Optic Base PSA 10, 41 sales of that card for an average of $48. And CJ Stroud's 2023 Prism Base PSA 10, 36 sales for an average of $70.32. Stroud's Don Russ base PSA 10, 33 sales, $39, and his Optic Hollow PSA 10, 27 sales, $257. Then we get into Josh Allen, 2018 Don Russ base PSA 10, 
23 sales, $124 average sale price. All right, now let's go to the category that gets everybody the most excited. Sales in the last seven days in the football card market by top last sale price. Patrick Mahomes, 2017 Optic Gold Vinyl out of 10 in BGS 9.5, sold yesterday for $31,100. Derrick Henry's 2016 Prism, 298 Black Finite, one of one in BGS 9.5, nonetheless, sold on October 20th for $27,000. Roger Staubach, 1972 Tops, 200 base PSA 9, sold on October 20th for $17,400. Tom Brady, 2000 SP Authentic Base, serial numbered out of 1250 in BGS 9.5, sold on October 16th for $11,500. All right, now if we go to top football cards with five or more sales in the last seven days by last sale price, Barry Sanders, 1989 score, 257 base PSA 10 is number one. Sold yesterday for $1,270. Anthony Richardson, 2023 Optic Downtown PSA 10, before they made the oversized downtowns, of course, but this is out of Optic. Uh, sold yesterday for $1,060. And Jamar Chase, 2021 Optic Downtown PSA 10, sold yesterday as well for $871. All right, top risers by price change percentage in the last seven days with 10 or more sales. Anthony Richardson, 2023 Optic. Hollow 247 PSA 10 is up 117%, believe it or not. So Anthony Richardson being back on the field, helping out his value quite a bit, up $108. Justin Herbert's 2020 downrust base PSA 10 is up 54% or $9. Trevor Lawrence with a much better showing this past Sunday in London. His 2021 downrust base PSA 10 is up 43% or $6. Now, Let's go to the biggest fallers by price change percentage in the same category. C.J. Stroud, putrid performance this past weekend against the Green Bay Packers. 2023 absolute 102 base PSA 10 down 44% or $17. His 2023 Donruss base PSA 9 down 42% or $7. Joe Burrow's 2020 Prism 307 base PSA 9 down 41% or $14. Guys, Today's episode brought to you by CGC Cards, the perfect place to slab your favorite sports cards. From their crystal clear holders to their affordable pricing, CGC Cards is the perfect stop for your grading needs. Go to cgccards.com to start grading today. On October 10th, a beautiful 2021 Mosaic Dan Marino White Sparkle sold in CGC 10 in a buy it now for $75. Thank you for joining us on the weekly football card market update. Don't forget to like this at youtube.com slash Paul Hickey. Comment, share, leave us a five-star review on your favorite podcast app, and stay tuned for our Monday and Wednesday Sports Card Strategy Show full episodes and Tuesday's Football Card Quest full episode on the Sports Card Strategy Show feed. Please get a free 30-day trial over at nooffseason.com today to get all the tools you need to make money flipping sports cards. Everybody, thanks so much for joining us. Again, thanks to our sponsor, CGC Cards. I'm Paul Hickey. Have a great day.